What up my awesome viewers, Real Gion here. We're gonna take a look at the Trimmy the Ever Playful Budget Timmy Bill-ish. It's not a freaking sweet bill because I don't think there's that many expensive cards here for a freaking sweet bill. Or good cards for all that matter. So yeah. Let's take a look at the the basic stuff, huh? The the pillars of what I believe is magic. Draws and ramp. So I put search and draw as well. So we have Diabolic Tutor, Master Maya Acquisitions. These are two pretty basic. You're kind of. I was gonna say the other word, but you know I don't want to get demonetized. But your basic search cards are here. Yeah. Commander Insight. And I gotta zoom out a little bit, out a little bit so we can see the full text. There you go. It's craving, divinity, divination. I mean, life crafter, bestiary, beast wooden. This is pretty good for draws. Ambitious cost, basically the same thing. The mole drifter. You gotta have that silky flying fish. Return a wild speaker. Return of the focusing, there we go. Uh, Underworld Connection, so I actually found this card now. So this is something that I would recommend over uh, Phyrexian Arena if you're on a budget, you don't want to spend 10 bucks on essentially this, but you know, not attach your land, so yeah. Looks pretty sweet card. Harmonize. And we got your ramp. pretty good they don't come in tap that's a good thing about this card explosive veggies cultivate far haven elf she's I, I i think it's a girl i think it's a girl but if it's not whatever enters in basically sad robot but went off the draw so yeah far seek that's wood surge Kodama's Reach, Soul Ring, what else? Three visits on a body. That's pretty sweet. So we got our draws and ramp. We have the I don't care mute tape. That's what I'm gonna categorize this as. So it needs to have mute tape. So we got the Brokos. Got the octopus, the horse, the bird, the bat, the gnar, spider, demolisher, the wolf, I think. I think this is a wolf. Gem razor. And then the night dude, the, the, the really cool nightmare beast. I, I think these guys look really interesting so I, I don't know what this is like a mutated rat or something like that uh, the great horn basically uh search for tomorrow on a mutate another nightmare looking bat the chittering harvester i always like to say this name this this name sounds interesting each opponent sacks a creature Pretty legit. The Bone Yard Lurker. The Cavern Whisperer. Dude, the artwork on these nightmare creatures looks so freaking cool. So we got the I Don't Care Mute Take. Then we gotta have the Cool Carriers. Even Fleetwood. Basically, a uh, fly in the hex proof. Two pretty decent keywords. The Wolverine Rider. Basically, a budget um, Tender Shoot Dryad. <laughs> there you go. Uh, I, I almost forgot. Yeah. This is a budget Tender Shoot Dryad. Dark Steel Mirror. It's really legit. Koai Selki. The Scout. Run 
Pro Aesthetic, the Lead Walker, the Bogle, the Hydra, and the Constable. So those are those are the cool carriers. And then we got I need a little revive. Revive cards. There you go. Recollect and regrowth. In green, that's pretty good. Uh, because you don't want them to hit the field. Because if you were to hit like a I don't care mutate, you actually want them in your hand. So I picked these over the typical revives. And plus these are very cheap in terms of money. So that's also a good plus. Board wipes. One in doubt, if you don't need a board wipe, get at least two. I have three. Yep, Garrett's Wake, Curse of the Swine, Izuri Predation. This is a pretty sweet card. I think it's only like five bucks now because it got reprinted. Yeah, I got it in the pre con, so good stuff. Got some equipment because I'm also kind of doing. Somewhat Voltron-y. I, I think Mutate is more or less Voltron because you're adding in keywords and effects. So you're not adding in a lot of power though. But yeah, there's that. I think this is relatively expensive. It's probably like 10 or 20 bucks now. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. This has always been a sweet card. And we just have like miscellaneous cards that I think are pretty good in the deck. Petrify. The Rollock, Propaganda, Brawn, So Conduit, uh, when in doubt, swap your life. Because if you don't have lifelink, which this deck doesn't really have lifelink, just swap it with someone else that does. Beast Within, Cassette, Cage Breaker. Yeah, I know it doesn't work with the I don't care mutate, but a lot of the times when one of the mutate hits the graveyard, there's a bunch of monsters in there, so let's turn them into wolves and attack. Rex Sage, Crozen Grip on a Body, Wonder, Everything is Flying. Uh, that's a pretty good keyword. Essence Symbiote. This is pretty good actually, because uh, it gives the, the I don't care mutate the plus one, plus one. I don't have the polywart because I don't have it. <laughs> but if I do, I would put it in, but I don't have it. I think I pretty much clears up everything and then it's time for the lands. The only lands worth mentioning are, are these guys. The, the Exotic Orchid, Chop Estuary, Command Tower, Drown Catacombs, Terramorphic Expanse. Evolving Wilds, the Myriad Landscape. And then that's pretty much it. Everything else is basic. Uh, so, basically, the rule of thumb, <laughs> pun was only intended, the rule of thumb is to have 14 7 7. So, 14 forests, because you run ramp, 7 swamps, and 7 islands. So, yep, that's. Basically the basic lance. And yeah, that's pretty much the deck. What do you guys think? You guys like the build? You guys don't like the build? If you have more money, I'm pretty sure you can make it better. You can throw stuff like Ristic Study and all that good jazz. 30 bucks. So, yeah. Overall, I, I like it. I think it's a it's a pretty decent deck. Yeah, let me know. Comment down below. Like, subscribe, the bell, comment, thumbs up. Also support me directly in Locals down below as well. You guys stay awesome.